to go get my nails done with Mercedes, my sister. It is 11.19 right now. Just grabbed one of my Red Bulls. Haven't eaten anything yet today. But I did plan to go get my nails done with Brianna, but my sister's been wanting to get her fucking nails done and Brianna, Brianna's taking too long. AKA she's waiting for a check and then blah, blah, blah. It's not her top priority to get her nails done. This is what my nails look like right now. I don't know if it's gonna focus or not. We're gonna do a little detour because they're fixing a pole utility work ahead. I don't even know if this road's fucking good or not. Bridge that collapsed over here months ago. But they don't get that shit done for a while. So, who knows. I've gone through a lot of style shit. When we were in like middle school, intermediate school I wanna say, there was that phase where everyone was wearing like patterned everything. Everything, leggings were the big thing. How the fuck did we as a society go through a legging phase like that? I think I might be lost, oh my God. There's no way I just got lost on these back roads. Oops! Ow, oh, my fucking leg, bro. My leg, you got dirt on it. I'm here with Sadie. Show you oh, your nails. My hands look like old lady hands. <laughs> These are mine. Why are you touching me? I need a little background. <laughs> look my at that leg. shit. <laughs> this shit looks good. Got going for us. Oh, I should have grabbed my phone. Take a picture. Look how white I am. Hold on, give me a second. <laughs> Oh, it is hot. It is hot, hot, hot. And you might be thinking, if it's so hot, why are you wearing the jacket? First off, it's a little mini jacket. So, oh my God, y'all don't understand. If you have a car that works perfectly fine, everything is on it, be grateful. Cause some people, not all their windows work. Some people only have one and a half sunroof but that don't count i'm going home i i can't get enough of these nails picture perfect maybe orange is my new color i don't think i've ever had orange nails look at my back look at my back just from the car ride i don't understand how all my laundry piles it's not even piled up i just did a load like a couple days ago but i'm like i guess i'm more confused of how i'm actually wearing all these clothes because I barely get late. I don't know if I already said this, but like at two in the morning, I went shopping on Sephora. Don't really know exactly why I was on there. And then I ended up buying three things for 120 something dollars. I'm like, what? What? I was more or less window shopping. And then it became real shopping. Got a package in the mail. This actually came pretty quick actually. So I'm pretty happy about that. I thought I was gonna have to wait till Monday. First, I got this Charlotte Tilbury face powder. What it looks like. Hopefully that's that's right for me. Cause I'm not that good at picking my colors out. The Pillow Talk Lip Wardrobe. See, literally this shit has been open. Look at this damn mascara. Like, what the fuck? You can tell somebody opens it. I got the bottom sex mascara, but as we just seen, that bitch was open. But I am gonna try that Pillow Talk lipstick right about now. So I just got back from the store. Or not the store, the post office. So I got a desktop phone stand. When I'm on live and then my phone dies, that's like it. We're done. My phone can't be charged and me be on live or doing something on my phone while sideways like that. I really like that. Okay, phone case. I need to be more organized with my money. So I bought this like money envelope thing, put cash in them for whatever the situation is. It has all these like little things on them so you can label them. I really want to buy a, I want to buy a microphone that you put on yourself so the quality of the sound and everything can be better because I feel like sometimes I'm just mumbling. So maybe eventually I'll buy one of those. I was at Best Buy the other day looking for a new computer and seen one, but it only connected to your phone and I don't know if that's the right one. I'll figure that out later. I feel like this will definitely keep me organized. I have a planner, but it's not like set up like this. I feel like this might help me. 10.35 in the morning. My package said it was delivered at 9.30. I went to go look at the mail, it wasn't there. So I had to go to my grandpa's 
job. And go pick it up. I got my new mascara from Addison Rae's collection, the Adam Beauty. Drove to go pick this little thing up. It didn't even rip right. That wasn't even satisfying. It says, a dose of self-love, even though the bitch is ripped. This is what it looks like. Literally, a little blue top. The brush, or the applicator, whatever the fuck you want to call it, is the thing I was more... Look how small that is. That's exactly what I'm looking for. Because, like, I told y'all about how the bigger brushes are not it for me. I thought they were, but they're really not. So... We're gonna try this out. Hopefully, this becomes my new favorite mascara. It was affordable. It was affordable. Also, I wanted to do full glam. But I'm thinking about it right now, and do I really want to put on a full face of makeup? <clears throat> That's what I don't know. But I took a or I was on Pinterest last night, and I seen this picture of this eye. And I want to do that look low key, like a wet, blue, smoky eye. We're running low on time. So, yeah. My friend just texted me, she on the way. Okay. I'll show y'all when I get to the mascara. Okay, let me do this. Here's the makeup so far. Might put lipstick on, but anyway. I got a story to tell you guys really quick. And Brianna's right here. Who. So yesterday, there's this like old guy that lives down the road. When I used to work at a grocery store, he'd always like say my eyes were like pretty and stuff. So I just never thought anything of it. I thought he was just a nice old man. Well, he just asked Mercedes on a like out to eat with him, like at his house, and he, he was like, "Your boyfriend doesn't have to know and stuff." So that kind of made me feel weird. It made her feel weird. I tried to you know keep my hopes up, being like, "Oh, maybe he's just a nice old man." Blah blah blah, and try not to get the pervy vibe. Well, yesterday, I was out of the house for some reason, okay? I'm coming back, he's like leaving his driveway, and I'm like trying to speed, cause I'm like trying to like go quick so I don't have to like wave at him or anything. And he honks at me, right when I'm passing, and I'm still driving, like I'm not like waving or nothing. And I look at my rear view mirror, he's waving out his window. And I'm like, mm. oh, hopefully he's not coming the way I'm going. Hoping he wasn't gonna go down my road or something so I'm like speeding off I don't see him I see there's mail in the mailbox so I pull up get out of my car go to the mailbox next thing you know I'm checking through the mail I hear a car coming I look sideways and I see it's him and I'm like I can't fucking make it to my car I literally cannot make it to my car I was just standing there just I literally back to turned to him so he wouldn't try to stop and talk no this motherfucker stops to talk oh my god and he's like, hi, I'm a local. What's your name? Would you like to come eat dinner with me, me and my house? I eat alone and there's probably a reason you eat alone. I'm like, no thanks. Trying to be as nice as I can. I'm trying to be like, I'm trying to say, okay, you have a nice day now. So he can leave and so I can get the fuck back in my car. And he keeps talking and keeps talking. And he's like, do you work anywhere? I was like, not anymore. Not anymore. Because if I, I'm sure if I said where I fucking, if I worked anywhere, he would go there, harass me, because he harassed my sister. He kept talking, he kept talking, and I finally was like, all right, you have a nice day now. And then he asked how old I was after that. I'm like, I'm 20. I'm 20. He's like my grandpa's age, probably older. I said I'm 16. I was just thinking that, I'm like, I don't, okay, the thing is, when I'm on the spot, I'm not a fucking liar. I cannot fucking lie for some reason. Like, in the them. moment, you're like, <sighs> Ugh. Like I could have said my name was Brandy and I'm 17 or something. And then no, I- he'd be the one to go through your mail. That's what I'm saying! <laughs> That's what I was like. I was like, no, this motherfucker really knows where I fucking live now. Yeah, I just thought I should tell you guys what happened yesterday. It was not uh, amusing to me. And then I told my grandpa. I wasn't going to tell my grandpa, but I was in the shop with my mom and he was laughing. He was like, That's fucking weird. Like, he's my fucking age. And I'm like, yeah. Hey, yeah. He's making us- Making us very uncomfortable. A few inches later. I think I like these hair clips, but I don't think I do at the same time. I don't think I'm used to wearing hair clips. I don't know. Do they look fine or not, Brianna? Tell me the damn truth. 
Yeah, they looked fine. That's why I didn't say anything. Oh, okay. I mean, I don't fucking know, Brianna. <laughs> Sometimes I'll be wearing some weird shit. I know. But I'm just like, that's your style. We gonna let you do what you wanna do. Now we're gonna go to... We're gonna go shopping a little, I guess. It's just what we do every time we're fucking together. Yeah. So we're at Plato's Closet. I don't know if you can see the sign or not. But we're here now. We're in a window shop. If we find something good, we find something good. If we don't, it's not gonna be a big deal. Because money is something we're really not trying to spend right now. But if, you know, you find that piece, you find that piece. And then... You're happy. So we're gonna go do that. We went in there. First off, first off, the one we went to was closed, as we should have known. Same one, they just relocated. I bought three things, a white tank top, a white, white crop top, whatever the fuck you wanna call it. When I say that bitch is see-through, the damn, they're Hershey Kisses when you look at them. That's what, that's what it looks like. And it's just, uh, <laughs> like, what the fuck? But I'd have to find a bra or sticky pads that would be fine for it. But who are we kidding? I'm not gonna do that. No, you're just gonna go. I'm gonna freaking free ball it. Cause at the end of the day, who gives a fuck? Who gives a fuck? We all have nipples. Mmm. That's not better lighting. I also bought two dresses. Mm. One is Hawaiian themed. Is that what you say? I guess it would be. And then I just got this black lace dress. It was cute. I needed simple little black dress sizes like it's like i'll get to like the pants and watch her be like fucking it'll be on its like last leg mm -hmm. and i'll be like i'll buy them not even thinking and then i'll be like Fuck. wear them for like a week and they ruin it's like i did that once and like i didn't realize mm -hmm. week later the fucking thighs rip just your luck you want to get starbucks yeah. we can get starbucks and then come back around and like my brother actually forgot it like he left it at work because he like got home he he searched the whole house didn't find it it was at work and i was like Huh. But apparently she wants to go back out, so like that's good. You'll meet her too if you're at the baby shower because he's bringing. If her. I'm at the baby shower. Yeah. If I'm at, if I'm there. Yeah. If. You want me to post that clip or keep it out? I don't care. At this point, literally, it's okay. Been pregnant this whole time. Yeah, and I bet y'all never know, cause <laughs> how would you? It's just embarrassing when you hit somebody's car. <laughs> <laughs> Think yeah. about it, cause like you, you're just like, oh fuck, fuck. I'm screwed, cause you knew you weren't supposed to do that. Obviously there can be accidents and shit, but when you're not paying attention and it happens, and it's embarrassing. Like, Especially that's embarrassing. when you're, you hit like a nicer car. It's like a BMW or something, you know you're gonna have to pay pricey. Now this is where it gets a little weird. I don't understand what the fuck I'm saying in this next clip. Yes, yeah, she understands me. Listen, just listen. Dude, remember when I was fucking at this right here just terrible like nobody could get anywhere dude fuck that oh my god and we picked the it was like just the worst time to fucking even come out of traffic at any fucking point because it was rush hour i think mm -hmm. honestly it had to be if it was like that come they on they were coming to starbucks once and like the line was like out to like oh my fucking god. there yeah <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, they put these cones up so people would stop doing that sideways shit. So that's like kind of how it's supposed to be, but... Okay. <laughs> what the... Honestly, I don't even know if I'm going to keep the whole clip in. I don't know if I'm going to edit some of that out. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? No words. Probably try the pineapple passion fruit with the new fruit, obviously. We'll give you guys a little review for Starbucks. I always get a large and then I'll drink like half of it because it turns out I'm not thirsty or something. Do you have a woman's cup of sweet tea? You drink that shit so quick. Sweet tea's a different thing. That's a different breed. It's not even the same anything. Uh, can I get a large pineapple passion fruit refresher? Can I get a medium pink drink with no strawberries and two scoops of matcha powder? That's it. Alright, I'll see you at the window. Thank you. I guess we should. I'm gonna stop recording. Y'all, ain't nothing happening.
And here we are again. Our outro is really a thing anymore because I don't know the last time I really made one. Hope you enjoyed the video. One in the morning. I hope you're having a great day, great night, great week whenever you're watching this. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.